there, just refresh really. Dang it. Hey guys, uh, <laughs> this is probably already going up now, but uh, hello. We are live. We're gonna be opening some packs. Cause I'm probably gonna upload this straight to YouTube. All right, perfect. And I can just tweet this and post it here. All right, post it there, let's post it on Discord, and we should be good to go with the live stream. Let's see. We'll do some warm-up packs, get our hands nice and toasty. And all right, everything looks good and open. We can move this over here, move you over here. Make sure the stream looks okay. Frames are okay. And yes, yes, yes. All right, where's the stream? There's the stream. Uh, I know you'll be able to see the stream too. All right, hopefully this works. Yeah, this looks work. This looks good. All right. Where is how many people are here? There we go. Well, Luigi, I like cold soup though. Well, I mean, you're the weirdo. Synchro, don't serve me cold soup, or I'm telling you. Well, I'm glad you're here. You get nice and hot soup. <laughs> Let's warm up our hands and get some uh, get some of these locked packs open. Let's see. Yeah, so let's let's warm up. Let's get these hands nice and toasty. All right, let's close out of Discording tins. All right, let's pull some secret or uh, uh, ultra balls. And Carl with the host, my boy, as always. What's up, Carl? Here comes a danger up in this club. All right. Stream is looking like it's working, and that is already lovely. So we're going to open up 100 packs, thanks to our lovely sponsors at Guardian Gaming, which is why the logo is staying up there for now. And uh, we might give some packs away, probably closer to next stream, but we'll, we'll see. We'll see if I have any extras laying around after this. So I want to trade for all the stuff I need for videos. We have five Lost Thunder packs just chilling. Um, we'll open those last. What else is locked? Uh, Ultra Prism. Maybe else lock that like doesn't matter. No, not from the looks of it. I don't feel like I've lost all my packs. Cause I, I I used to collect these packs, man. Now they're not here. I see what's going on in the chat. Threatening me with cold soup? Well, I mean, are you here? Because if you're here, you get hot soup. Hey, have you tried the deck yet? The oh no, I haven't. I haven't streamed, bro. I want to stream more. And I'm going to stream more, but it's really awkward because uh, this semester has been really messy for me, combined with the fact that uh. Oh, what is this card? That's really cool artwork. Um, come out with the fact that Kingdom Hearts is out and I'm trying to play a game because I waited 13 years to play that game. And, uh, you know, just really, really busy with work as well. So, like, I don't know, man. I'm, I'm trying to stream and I'm going to do this pack opening and probably... Mm, I might not actually play any games tonight. I might just do the pack opening, maybe build a couple decks and then call it a night for today. And then maybe next time, like tomorrow, I'll be able to play some games. Eyes open up some Ultra Prism while we wait for lovely people to show up. Alright, who's gonna be the one that keeps track of my hits today? You should actually try it. I'm actually considering it for Madison. Oh, I mean, if it's that good. If it's that good. Oh, Darkrai. Do I even have this card? Oh, I have four of them. <laughs> so the only one? Do I have one more? I do have one more. Do oh, wait a minute. No, I gotta keep it because it's my last Ultra Prism pack. I need to get a f an actual Ultra Prism code so it, it doesn't have that awkward lock signal next to it. I want to see Pharaoh's Pharaoh seed built. I would love to play Ferrothorn. It looks like fun. I don't know how you would build it though, because like you need like three attachments onto it, three metal energy attachments onto it. Uh, all right, I believe we had five of these, so three more left into this one. I would love to play Ferrothorn. Ferrothorn looks like fun. Definitely destroys pre-release. Celebi, my second one. All right, cool.
All right, I think we can, I'm gonna wait till nine o'clock to start because I did say nine o'clock CST is when I'll start doing the pack opening. So I'm gonna give it a couple minutes before I actually start. We have like five minutes left until um, it reaches nine. Is that my last one? No, we got one more. The spread can get insane. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. The fact that you can hit the bench, I think it was like, was the hundred the cap? I don't actually remember. You guys wanna see something spicy that I'm working on? It's not really spicy, but like, uh, I've been working on making the cario work again. Oh, we gotta open up these dudes as well. Apparently I forgot these dudes. Burning shadows. I've been working on making the Lucario GX work, and since this format is like a lot of fighting, a lot of fighting weak stuff, I'm trying to I'm trying to work it. It's not a hundred to all. I thought it was just to one Pokemon. I'm pretty sure that's not how it works. I can double check though. I'm pretty sure you get to choose. So somebody was talking about playing this card in Meganium. Once during your turn, you may uh, have your opponents reveal their hand, put a basic Pokemon you find there into your opponent's bench, and put three damage counters on that Pokemon. I mean, it's interesting. If, uh, when the Dene comes out, I can see this being really useful. But it doesn't do enough damage for it to be actually strong. The ability is cool, though. But anyways, guys, don't forget to spread the good word of the stream. Tell people that we're live. We're opening up ult We're opening up 100 packs. Tell these people that we're here. Okay, we got three more minutes until we start opening our ooh Noivern. Hello buddy. Um until we start opening our packs. I think that's it for all the locked packs. Alright, let me let me show you guys what I'm working on. So apparently the new Lycanroc that's out only comes in a regular art, it doesn't come in a full art. Um so it's very that's very upsetting for me. Not that one. It's gotta be standard. Here we go. <sighs> So I wanted to do it with a new Lycanroc, so not this one. Let me actually remove these. And I think I'm going to probably play the 70 HP Rock Ruff. I don't think Corner is actually any useful anymore. Um, where my all caps? Alright, 70 HP boys. It's four of these. I'm thinking about doing... <clears throat> yes, the new Lycanroc. It doesn't come in a full art, which is super weird to me. Uh... Like, super duper weird to me. I don't know why it doesn't come in a full art. Maybe it does, and I'm just crazy. No, it doesn't look like it does. This is the hyper rare, right? Of the other one? Yeah, crunch. Yeah, it doesn't come in a full art. I guess we'll get a box for it eventually, but I do want to get these because I want to build Lucario again. So, Baby Feeny or Mars, Baby Marsha Delinquent for Collinsville? You mean Exodia? Um, Exodia is fun. Exodia does well. Uh, but this is what I want to try to build. I was thinking about playing Nine Tails, but like I only play one, two, three, four, like five different items, and I don't use rare candy, so I decided I'm not gonna play Nine Tails in this deck. Uh, but it's just Lucario. Lucario is strong. You have Acerola, you have Super Scoop Up. Although I don't think I'm really playing three Acerolas. I think two and maybe a Pal Pad. Uh, probably like two and a Pal Pad. Mm, maybe not. I know, I just don't feel like I need Ace because like, I'm not going to have time to use Ace Roll every turn. Which is why I'm not going to be playing Ace Roll. Or at least not that many. Only three seems to be okay. Although I don't know what I would replace for it. I don't know, what do you guys think I should put in this deck? I can maybe put like a Kukui in here. Kukui's never like bad. It's not great, but it's not bad. I mean, it's not... I shouldn't say it's not great, because it's still a really good card. And it helps you hit numbers. But uh, I'll just do this for now. I really want to try it out. I think combined with a new energy disruption, uh, with Lycanroc and Pokemon Communications, it could be really strong. Uh, but anyways, we got 12 viewers here. It's about to reach 9 o'clock. We're about to start opening packs. What do you guys think? We're going to do, do the thing again that we did last time. Um, <clears throat> I want everybody here to guess... What's the first ultra rare card I'm gonna I'm gonna get? Uh, Pokemon Fan Club. Actually, speaking of which, I could play Nest Ball in here. Uh, I think with Brooklet, Ultra Ball, and Pokecom, I don't think I need the Nest Balls. But if I really if I need help with consistency, I could just play Nest Balls. Something to keep in mind. I can maybe drop some stuff. But anyways, thank you, Mini UK, my boy. What's up? I love Pokemon Communications. I'm really excited for it. I haven't I've never actually played in a format where it was huge, except for like Legacy, I guess.
<clears throat> okay, so we're gonna do what we did last time. So guess, um, assuming you do get an ultra rare, ultra rare of what? Okay, this, oh, assuming I do get an ultra rare, I'm gonna hope that in 100 packs I get an ultra rare, right? But guess the ultra rare I'm gonna pull first. Any ultra rare, you, but you have to let me know the rarity. Like if you can't just say Snorlax and Eevee, you gotta tell me Snorlax and Eevee, full art, alternate art, regular art, hyper rare, that kind of thing. There's no art and art for Snorlax and Eevee. But um, whoever guesses correctly, uh, yeah, you're right. Now, whoever guesses correctly will get a pack, a nice team up pack. But if none of you guessed correctly, you guys all owe me a pack. It's just part of the bet. You know, it is what it is, right? Like, I don't make the rules, I just make the rules. <laughs> but we are here. We are ready to start. Um, let's do this. We have 100 packs to open today, thanks to our lovely sponsors, wherever the freaking packs are. Mr. Packs, where are you at? I'm sorry, am I just blind? <laughs> Where does it say 200? Did I just lose all my packs right there? All right, dope. Um, Gengar Full Art. That's one I want IRL, bro. All right, <laughs> let's do it. Let's crack these bad boys open. All right, so moderators, I need you to keep track in the chat. Hopefully you guys can scroll up and down and let me know if anybody did guess it right. Uh, I know that my thing is not exactly the most consistent. Actually, you know what I can do? Let me get my phone and um, try to keep the chat open. That way, there's no shenanigans. Because <clears throat> we don't want shenanigans. No siree. 35 bless the packs. Guys, put your hands in the air. Put that... Put, give me all of your aura. I need your energy. It is what it is. <laughs> Alright, where's the chat? Stream chat? Alright, here's the stream chat. Alright, so starting now, guess what you think my first ultra rare is going to be. I have the stream chat up on my phone now. <sighs> Alright, let's do this. Oof, I'm excited. I'm excited. I love, I love new sets, man. Oh yeah, they have new energies now. All right, so if you go second, this Pokemon can evolve during your first turn. Huh. That's not what I thought it was. I thought you could just evolve it immediately. So you have to go second for Bronze Ore to be active, to, to be effective. That's interesting. Um, <clears throat> so we got Roy saying um, normal Gengar Mimikyu, Full Art Erica. This man is hopeful. Snorlax Full Art, Hoopa Full Art. All right, let's do this. Uh, Already with the black market. Oh god, that's pretty nice. That's pretty nice. I don't I won't count on as ultra rare. Just just for your sake. <laughs> when a dark type Pokemon uh, that has a dark energy attached to it is knocked out by downstream opponent's attacks, the player takes one fewer prize card. So dark decks are trying to make a resurgence, so that's really cool. Definitely can't wait to try out Incineroar in this format, even though I don't think Incineroar is that good. And Kabutops, we're gonna start off with some supporter luck. Who boy. Alright. <clears throat> Let me know you guys think we're gonna pull first. Let me know, let me know. And don't forget to share the stream, man. Let people know that we're here. Uh, nuzzle Gathering. Once during your turn, you may search your deck for a Pokemon that has a Nuzzle attack, reveal and put it into your hand. And then Nuzzle, yada yada. All right, cool. Uh, anything interesting here? What is this Golduck and why is there so much text? Broken Stadium on the first pull, pretty much. Uh, Two of your opponents like the Pokemon that attack, this Pokemon can use you. Oh, it's Amnesia. If you want any water, you need to do okay, whatever. Boring. It's, it's artwork is like super epic though. Anyways, more importantly, yata, another Kabutops. All right, I can see where this is going. <laughs> I have a bad feeling where this one's going. I don't see your hands in the air, guys. Put those hands in the air. All right, what do we got here? Zapdos already. People love him. People love him. People hate him. Uh, Zapdos retrade and B drill. So everyone loves this B drill. I don't like it very much, but. <clears throat> You can use this tag only if your Pokemon has any damage counters on it. Both active Pokemon are knocked out. So the whole idea is that you want to trade, right? But how do you put damage counters on Pokemon? I guess you just play Shrine. Because it's only useful. Like, don't you lose against anything that isn't a GX deck? <laughs> I don't know, man. I guess you can play it with, um, with Shininja. 
all those all those high evolution Pokemon. There it is. There it is. The card I want the most out of this set. IRL. Oh, what a good card. Um, you hear that? The promo Pikachu with muzzle is out too. Oh, oh yeah, the new the new Pikachu. <gasps> who guessed Pikaram? I don't know who guessed Pikaram, but nobody from the looks of it has guessed Pikaram. Hmm. Looks like nobody gets a pack out of this one, but. We got ourselves one peak rod. You guys know I really want the regular arts the most because, you know, what am I going to do with the high rarities besides trade them away? So, now that we already pulled one, <laughs> things are looking kind of good. It's way better than all the past ones. Remember the past ones where we had to go like 30 plaques where we actually opened an ultra rare? Uh, all right. Well, we got one peak around out of the way. Let me know in the comments, in the chat, I mean, what do you think the next ultra rare we're going to pull is? Yeah, let me know now. <laughs> let me know now. I'll give you guys like one minute to put in your guesses remember if you guess right you get the you get one tag team pack i got a couple codes chilling right here but hey we got peek around full blitz this is such a good card man you take up the three lightning energies attach them to one of your pokemon you know nobody's talking about the fact that you can like throw this into other random decks like you can i mean throw random other pokemon into this deck like you can play this with like a one of snorlax or something like that so it's like use colorless energies and then you can use that snorlax to help you beat things like like some zoric easier since you can't really oko zoric without the need to use all of your electro powers and stuff <clears throat> look at all these guesses pikaram gengar still normal like gengar full art full art erica's hospitality you guys are you guys are adamant still feeling full art snorlax all right let's do this Let's do this. Let's, I, I want to open Flyers on Oxford, guys. I mean, I, online, I don't care. But IRL, bro, I really want it. There's so many cards I want. All right. Let's see. And ba-boom. Parasect. Pull that Gengar alternate R, baby. <laughs> All right. Oh, look. Dangerous Drill. I haven't actually tested with this card yet. I, I need to play Zoark. Like, in a, maybe a video or something like that. Like, an IRL video that plays, like, a bunch of Dark Energies and stuff and Weaviles. Um... You have to discard a dark Pokemon, discard Pokemon tool or special energy card from one of your opponent's Pokemon or discard a stadium card. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Eveltal, Derail, and Clutch. All right, cool. Boring. Boring. Moving on. Moving on. You got AT viewers here. Hey, guys, don't forget to hit that follow button if you don't follow me on Twitch already. Uh, let's see. Anything interesting here? What's this Skarmory do? Calm Strike. I like how they have this new bold GX thing. If you use and if you, if you have used your GX attack, this attack does 70 more damage. So you can hit 90. Uh, 90 with a choice band is 120. You can knock out things like Guardy. That's pretty cool. <clears throat> so if you have a deck that focuses on using its GX attack early, like in the next set with uh, Lucario Memorial. By the way, guys, my mind is all over the next set right now. Uh, you could technically use this as a way to low energy attack, but I mean it's not that great. It's not a good card. Let's see, Water Memories. You guys already know with Water Memory, we can update our Soul Valley deck to play Metal Energies and use Water Memory now. Oh, that's so exciting. And, ba ba boom another Kabutops. We got the deck ready. <laughs> I'm telling you, man, I know where this stream is going. <clears throat> Kabutops is going to be our new Malasada. <laughs> Mareep, I hope we get a uh, Ampharos, because I really want to play Ampharos. Oh, the other, another Black Market. Well, who wants to win a Black Market? <laughs> And Galvantula. I don't know. I don't know if this card's good. I don't think it's good. Oh, you can't wait for confusion stall. Oh no. Oh no. Please no. Are the memories for Savali fixed already? Are they fixed? What do you mean fixed? <clears throat> With the bad Tapu Lele. Oh. And change clothing. I don't know. I don't know what you're talking about. Mandibuzz. Discard an item card from your hand if you do this attack to 60 damage to one of your opponent's Pokemon. Uh, okay. That's pretty cool. Knock out some babies. Yay, black market for the win. <laughs> so many black markets. Alright. Give me some cool stuff. Give me some stuff I need. Needle King, you're not one of those things, bro. We're 12 packs in, guys. We're 12 packs. Don't forget to share the stream. Just love the stream. Because nobody guessed Jasmine. And this is my girl. I'm really excited for this card. I need to get one IRL. Because <clears throat> look, at, first of all, look at how beautiful this full art is. She's gorgeous. Jasmine's always been one of my favorites, bro. Um, she's a metal type user. She's going to be helping me in the future. Uh, a 
I'm excited for this one. But anyways, that's the next culture, eh? Go ahead and let me know what your next guess is in the chat. Switch your deck for, the, for a metal Pokemon, reveal and put it into your hand. Kind of boring. If you go second and it's your first turn, switch your deck for five metal Pokemon instead of one, then shuffle your deck. So uh, there's a bunch of different metal decks that are coming out. Like you can use this to search a, a bunch of like Magnazones and things like that. If you are playing Magzone, if you're playing Duskmane, if you're playing Lucario Melmetal, if you're playing the new Melmetal, things like that. It's pretty handy if you go second. <clears throat> Not even gonna lie. Um, and then if you have cards like Pokecom and Ultra Ball, you can easily find your Leles. And you can Pokecom one of those metal Pokemon into something more useful. Um, cool. Alright, let's move on. Looks like people got a bunch of their guesses in. Let's move on to the next one. You guys are guessing all the things I want, too, so keep that coming. Keep that energy coming. Whoa, what is this Pangor? Dude, look how epic this artwork is. The opponent discards two cards from their hand. That's not even bad. This Pokemon is now confused. That's pretty bad. <laughs> Alright, moving on. Look at that. Look at Jasmine. What a lovely lady. What a lovely lady. Bronzong. Prevent all damage on this Pokemon by attacks your opponent's fire type. Plus, it has heat proof. Yada yada. Boring. I guess it's kind of cool if you play Bronzong Break and Expanded. I mean, whatever. What was your first Ultra Rare? We got Pikaram first, and then we got Jasmine. That's it so far. We're about to be 20 packs in, and now we have Venusaur. You guys are just not on your game tonight. You guys need to. You guys need to get on your game. Like y'all are not guessing these cards. What am I gonna do with all these extra packs? Excuse me. If you guys can't guess correctly, <laughs> put those guesses in the chat. Uh, Venusaur of Celebi is one of my favorite decks, I think, to come out of this set. It's very stally and gross and mean, and I usually don't like stally gross decks, but this one actually takes prizes, which is why I think it's really interesting and fun. Uh, <laughs> I don't know how to set in my defense. I don't know how to set, dude. Get to Googling. Get to Googling. <laughs> uh, Pollen Hazard is the best thing about this card. You can sit here, tank hits, and then you can confuse, burn, and poison them, which means that you're essentially doing 80 damage, but more importantly, they're confused, which means they have to flip to attack you, which is really strong because if they flip to attack you and they get tails, then you take no damage, giving you more time to heal, tank hits, attach energies, and then if you get too low, you can hit them up with the Evergreen. And if you want to shuffle all your cards back in the deck, you can do that too, but it's never really necessary. Uh, I don't feel like you need to shuffle your... Like, in most games that I've ever seen with Celebi and Venusaur, you don't really care about using the second effect. All you care about is healing yourself by attacking. Uh, it's like Bulu, but really tanky and very strong and very useful. Pokecom, our first one. Sabrina, I wish this card was good because I love Sabrina. More waifus just everywhere, bro. Your opponent reveals their hands. <laughs> you may choose a supporter card you find there and use the effect. It's so it'd be cool if it said discard that supporter. Like it'd be really useful if it was discarding that supporter because a lot of decks play the same supporters. So you play a couple of Sabrina suggestions, you copy the effects if you get lucky, and you keep them with a stuck hand if they have too many, too many if they don't have any more draw supporters in their hand. That's really good. Uh, and <laughs> our first secret rare, dangerous drill. Once again, guys new things <laughs> new guesses in the comments in the chat new guesses y'all are not on your a game tonight <laughs> y'all dude speaking of a game though we're on our a game we're pulling out really well what is that like three four what do we get so far jasmine pikaram venusaur and dangerous drill that's four ultra rares <clears throat> Hmm, dang, I was so close. You were really close. Out of how many packs? 15, 16 packs? It's not bad. Every four packs is an ultra rare. That's pretty good. I'll take that. Sticking with Buzzwell Tag Team? I don't think it's in this set, but buddy. Uh, Pheromos of Buzzwell is in the next set. Oh, here's the Honage. Oh, there's the Mr. Mime. I actually want this reverse IRL. So if anybody gets this reverse IRL, let me know, because I want it. Cut down, flip a coin, and discard an energy from your opponent's hack to Pokemon. There is a golden Pokemon communication. That's one I want a bunch of IRL. I want my playset because I want to play in Lucario. Who said Venusaur? I'm pretty sure I saw somebody say Venusaur. 
But that's two. Oh, this one he said full art, not the regular art. Mmm. 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 That's two though. That's two. <laughs> What's up, Eagle Heart? My boy, Eagle Heart. My MVP, Eagle Heart. Right now we're playing a game for all of you new viewers. Uh, guess what the next ultra rare I'm going to pull is first. And if you guess it correctly, anybody that guesses it correctly gets a pack. Even if like I have 5, 10, 15 winners, you guys all will get a pack. Um... <clears throat> my boy Eagle Heart is here, one of my top donators on the channel. Everyone, everyone, let's get some wilds in the chat for Eagle Heart. It's my boy. Um, regular tag team. All right, Mr. Mime regular. Next is going to be Cobalion. Uh, it's going to be expensive. Yeah, I really want them though. Like, because if I want to play Lucario, because I'm already, my, my Lucario is already maxed out that's as far as the deck goes. I'm just, now I'm just missing the Pokecoms. But, anyways, moving on. <clears throat> I'll just work. I'll, I'll work and get the money for it. It's meme sore time. <laughs> and Mightyena. I mean, why do cards like this? Why are these rares? Like, can somebody can somebody talk to Pokemon Company and start? And can we can, can we petition to remove rares? <laughs> is there is there a petition that lets us do that? Because I would love to remove some rares. And <laughs> it's the big boy. It's the big boy. Look at this big boy. I, 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 I. Dude, we're pulling really well tonight. We're pulling really well tonight. Uh, I don't think anybody guessed this one either. So, uh, so far, no winners. Will you be the winner? Will you guys be the first winner? Uh, <laughs> there's a lot of ultra rays in the set, now that I'm thinking about it. Super Splash, 180. Uh, I mean, I know all about this card. We definitely, as if you're an Orbomb viewer, then you know everything about this card already. And my Twitch is freaking out, but what else is new? Uh, why is, what's happening? Hmm, strange. Oh, well. Fixed. Moving on. Get those guesses in. I'm seeing those guesses. I'm seeing those guesses. My thick boy is here. My thick boy, look at him, look how happy he is. This man is just cheesing. He's like, hey, <laughs> people like me again. <laughs> All right, let's go. Regular Zekrom, Pikachu, I would like that. I need like at least one more. I don't think I'm gonna play more than two in most of my decks anyways, but three is like the safe number. Kabutops, Kabutops doesn't count. It has to be an ultra rare. It's gotta be an ultra rare. I'll give you one chance. I'll give you one time to change your answer. It's gotta be an ultra rare though. I was gonna guess Hyper Carp Lord, but I thought it was too risky, so I didn't do it. <laughs> You gotta take the risk, bro. We're 20 packs in, guys, and I believe we've opened up six ultra rares so far. So that's pretty good. I like those odds. I do like those odds. And here it is, our fourth Kabutops. Oof. There's the man. The man that does not want to leave us alone. I want Blastoise. Oh, the regular Blastoise. I actually can't wait for the next Blastoise. Um, Blastoise GX. I feel like it, I mean, the synergy is obvious, right? But I, that card could be good. I don't know if it's actually going to be good, but it looks like fun to play. Do we have enough of these dudes yet? We need to make sure we have three of each at minimum. Uh, Lapras. <clears throat> oh, the grass memory. Oh my god, I love Sil Valley. I need to go buy me some Florida Sil Valleys again, man. That was one of my favorite decks to play. The fairy version of Mimikyu, meh. I mean, just literally meh. If dragons start taking over the format, it's good, but until then, it's kind of meh. And it's only good in counter energy decks. That Lapras is pretty decent. I'll take a look at it next time. Uh, I just completely wrote it off because most Lapras cards are whatever. Top of Cocoa Prism. Glad we have this. It's finally out of the way. It doesn't count as the Ultra Rare guys though. And another Moon Salt Mega Mega Punch. Speaking of Moon Salt, dude, they buffed Incineroar in in Smash, and I'm pretty excited to play Smash again. All right, this is a new one. So we have only one of her. Kabutops Ramming Shell takes up 20 less damage. I mean, you hit for 40, which is not bad for one energy. And Mr. Mime. I know somebody guessed Mr. Mime earlier. I don't think they guessed it again, but let's double check. Yeah, I don't see anybody guessing Mr. Mime. Uh, but we got Mr. Mime now to go with the other Mr. Mime. He's the glowing eye meme. <laughs> Kabutops. <laughs> yeah, nobody guessed Mr. Mime that time, but somebody did it earlier. So magical odds, we have magical evens already, but this one is magical odds, so I mean potential stall decks, I guess. I have two of the other ones. God, these are ugly Pokemon. 
It's Mr. Space Pork's favorite Pokemon. If you guys remember him. <laughs> it was typed a while back. <laughs> Is Nita Flora here? If so, that's the next one. Yes. The floor of all the ladies are here. I think every supporter in this set has a full art. So that's pretty cool. I like how they, I mean, the floor supporters, or aka the people cards, as my friend likes to call them. <laughs> I still think it's the funniest thing ever. She called them people cards. Anyways, I hope you guys got those guesses in because we're moving on. Looking at this chat real quick to see if people have guessed anything. Ah, oh, Viridian City Reverse. If anybody pulls any of these IRL, let me know. Let me know. I need to get a playset of them. I need to get a playset of the reverses. Uh, I need them. I need them. Uh. Oh, what does this card do again? Once during your turn, that player may look at their opponent's hands. Okay, cool. I didn't even stop on Tropical Shake. Didn't even. I mean, it's just we've seen Tropical Shake. It's just Dragon type. It's cool because you have access to uh, Lance, but other than that, like other than Lance and I guess Altaria, it's not interesting. I guess technically, if you want to play it with Lance Prism, it's easier to get your Altarias out, and you could tech in things like Dragonite to get supporters constantly. So if you want to take the Dragon Spin to it, that's fine. I just don't really see how it's beneficial. Uh, grass is a little bit more support. Actually, I don't know. Does Grass have more support? I mean, you have access to Lorantis, which is the same thing as Altaria. But it's easier to set up because you have Netball as opposed to a Mysterious Treasure. You know what I mean? I don't know. It's not bad, for sure. It's not bad. We'll, we'll, we'll probably play around with it at some point. See if it's any better as a Grass version or a Dragon version. What's that Executor? This man's fallen. Timber, bro. Timber. Ah, Brock. Look at my man. You know, they call me the Arabian Brock. I don't know if you guys know this. Um... Need a queen. I love me some Need a queen. She's such a good, such a good card, man. I'm on the road to Viridian City. Viridian Forest. <laughs> All right, what do we got here? Another black market. <laughs> I think I'm gonna do a black market giveaway at the end of this pack opening. I think that's what we'll do tonight. <laughs> at least one, right? Aerodactyl. This is a cool card. If you don't have any GX or EXs, you hit 180, essentially. It's not bad. I don't know if it's a great card, but hitting 180 is definitely decent. But it's not good enough if you're playing against tag teams, right? You can play with Shrine, I suppose. Just play four Shrines and <clears throat> Fossil Aerodactyls, Malamar, things like that. Speaking of fossils, oh, our boy Omastar is here. That's pretty cool. I mean, you could technically play with Omastar, too, but almost it's never going to work if you're playing with Malamar, right? So... The Mysterious Treasure Discard, which is the good part, I guess. But you're probably going to be playing Shuckle anyways because you want that immediate damage. Shuckle just makes it super convenient, which is where the Netball comes into play. The Fairy version, I need to actually give me this card to continue my my Alola Ninetales collection. Um, if anybody has any Alola Ninetales cards, I want to start my collection. I'm almost starting from scratch. I have none of the GXs anymore. Uh, but I would love to collect these cards at some point because I love Alola Ninetales. They're just so expensive, the Fairy ones in particular. And I just sold my fairy one for like $40, $50. It's crazy. The herd is coming. The herd. Who's, what's the herd? Uh, Hitmonlee. I actually want to get me these because I really like that Hitmon top card or whatever. Oh, somebody did guess Cobalion. I don't know if they guessed it again, but Cobalion is really cool. I actually like Cobalion. I feel like people are kind of sleeping on it. Like with all this confusion, and burn, paralysis kind of things and Venusaur running around, Cobalion is definitely not bad. I know uh, Waluigi guessed it earlier, but I think she switched it up. Yeah, she guessed Eevee Snorlax full art. Unfortunate. Eagle Heart, did you do it? You did an Eevee Snorlax regular, so you, you mixed it up. Um, but I know you did earlier, and I know Waluigi did earlier too. <clears throat> Let's see if there's anybody else that... Yeah, I don't see anybody else that guessed it. Um, big oof, big oof on Waluigi's part, but it's really cool. His GX attack is super good in any deck, though. Uh, during your opponent's next turn, their Pokemon can't attack. So, literally straight up, this includes Pokemon that come into play that turn. They just can't attack. Your opponent cannot attack your next turn, no matter what. That's a really strong GX attack. If you're, especially in, like, a setup-based deck, uh, even Pokemon that come into play can't attack, the only way to ruin that is Pokemon Ranger, which doesn't exist in Standard. So, Cobalion is literally a one-turn stall card. Uh, which you guys, if you guys that play, uh, people that play, um, 
Chime Echo. It's similar to that, uh, except it's similar, but not exactly the same. Uh, people that play Gengar Mimikyu, it's really similar to that, except it's a little bit stronger. You don't get the draw, but you get the ability for them to not attack at all. I mean, I don't know, it's similar. But it's re it's a really strong jet attack. If you need a, if you need a card that's like just decent, if there's the same card in place, attack the 60 more damage. Hits 110, 140 with a choice ban. It's not bad. That knocks out every Pokemon that's weak to fairy with a choice ban. Um, you have those stay in play. If your Pokemon that has any metal energy attached to it cannot be affected by special conditions. And like metal types are just strong now. Alright. <clears throat> I'm guessing Seeker Rare and Cineroar. Ooh, it's going highballing right now. Roy saying need a full art. Sekiram and Pikachu. But the bull. Um, Tony, I finally made it. I was watching on the mobile in line for Target, but I finally made it to the battle station. Hey, what's up, bro? 170 HP too slow for the new meta. Too low? I mean, I mean, so is Lele. <laughs> this is just literally a card that will, will help protect you against a lot of different decks. Uh, Shock Lock is, is, people are talking about Shock Lock being good again. Um, people are talking about Venusaur being good. It's literally just, hey, I play this deck that uses Metal Energies, throw this in, boom, Iron Rule is strong as well. Like, Iron Rule is actually really funny against like Venusaur because they can't use their GX attack to heal up as well. Remember to guess guys, if you if you just got here, guess the Pokemon you think is gonna be pulled out next. Uh, if you win, if you guess correctly, you do get a pack. <clears throat> do this higher HP than Magirna, you are right. All right, let's see what we got going on here. Do you guys think we're gonna get secret rares of these uh, of these brand new energy cards? I hope not. I like I think they're cool, but I don't I don't need more secret rares in my life. Uh, non hollow Charizard. It has to be an ultra rare. So make sure you guess ultra rare. Is it an IRL pack we get? No, no, you get the code. <laughs> I don't have any IRL packs to give. Somebody guessed this. I know somebody guessed this this time. Um, Maybe, maybe I'm wrong. Oh, Blaster9902. He did guess correctly. We got a Pikachu and Zekrom GX. Blaster, go ahead and DM me. And, uh, or, yeah, DM me preferably on Discord. Uh, if you can, DM me on Discord or Twitter, and I'll pass you a pack. All right, so we have a winner. My boy. That's awesome. I'm glad we have a winner. But we actually got two of these. <laughs> That's so rad. All right, cool. So we're here. We are out here. About to open up another pack. Um, but Blaster, be sure to message me, dude, because congratulations. Go ahead and guess packs, guys, before I before I pick this boy up. Guess what you guess what you think is gonna be next. I need some guesses before I pick this dude. Um, oh, I did I pass the muck? My bad. I was just too excited. We got there. We go. There's my guesses. There are the guesses I'm looking for. Gengar, Incineroar, Snorlax, Incineroar, all these people guessing regulars. You don't believe in me anymore? You guys don't believe that I'm going to pull Secret Rares or Full Arts anymore? <laughs> I see how it is. Anyways, I'm guessing Full Art Evelyn. Okay. Nita Full Art. All right, Roy and Waluigi believe in my luck. Gengar Rainbow Rare. <laughs> Only many UKs out here. <laughs> Pikachu GX. I don't want another Pikachu, uh, ideally. Uh, Secret Magilord. We already pulled one of these, bro. Uh... But if we pull another one, it'd be pretty nice. All right, we got plenty of guesses. Let's move this. I love the jazz, dude. I love the jazz, man. I've been spamming this jazz music in all my videos lately. Are we at the halfway point yet? Uh, oh, there's the muck that people were talking about. When you Pokemon, when you play this Pokemon from your hand to evolve one of your Pokemon, you may look at the top six cards of your opponent's decks and discard any number of item cards you find there. Uh, so you pair this with the other alone muck, and you pair this with things like Trash Lanch, and you have a deck essentially. So. That's pretty cool. The Heme has just followed as well. Shout out to you, boy. Welcome uh, to Orbomb Industries. There's Morgan. There is Morgan right there. The Mass Meowth was up, bro. Nice to see you, big dog. Um, <laughs> shut up. Uh, I just made a Lucario player rage quit because we both weren't taking prize cards. The difference is he ran out of ace rolls while my healing doesn't stop. <laughs> the uh, Dude, I'm telling you, man. People were sleeping on Venusaur, and then I uploaded my list, and people were just like, hmm, interesting. <laughs> I forgot this was happening today. <laughs> well, it's happening. It's happening right now. Tell the people. Let's get those follows. Let's get the subscriptions. We're, dude, we're almost at 5.6K on YouTube, which is really exciting. 
We're almost at 6k on YouTube. That's really cool. I think that's super dope. I'm playing off the Japanese list. Ooh. My list was very similar to the Japanese list. Hey, somebody guessed Snorvi. Somebody guessed Snorvi. Who guessed it? Um, somebody did guess. Oh, maybe they didn't. No, somebody did. Yeah, Snorlax. CDH. CDH out here with winning. Once again, DM me on Twitter or Discord, and I'll pass you a code. All right. You guessed the last round? Yeah, but I know somebody guessed it this round. I'm looking. I'm looking at the chat. Um, CDH, my boy, finally won. All right, guys. Let's get more guesses up here. More guesses. Snorvi is pretty cool. It's just like essentially anti Zoark because it doesn't actually hit that much damage. As much HP as it does, it only does 120, uh, which is not good to be honest, after testing it. Like it's literally only useful versus evolution cards, but it's very strong versus evolution cards. You're not pulling the most common GX? I'm not pulling Latios and Latios, you mean? Dude, I'm, I, I actually do want to get some Latios and Latios because I love that card. Hey, what's up? Mega Ray is overrated. Dude, I got sick Needle Queen Meganium build that is very consistent. You got a sick Needle Queen. We just uploaded a Needle Queen Meganium build on the YouTube channel today. So that's pretty cool. Um, remember to make those guesses, guys. Make those guesses. Make those guesses. I want to see them all. All right, let's get started. Uh, we're doing, we're pulling things that I want, which is good. What I don't have yet is any Incineroars. I don't need any Hoopas. Maybe like one Hoopa at some point, but I don't need that many Hoopas. Uh, oh, somebody guessed this way earlier. This makes our third Celebi and Venusaur. The full art's really pretty. I don't like this random blue outline they gave it, though. It's kind of ugly. It makes Celebi look really awkward. I'm not going to lie. Anyways, uh, because nobody guessed correctly and it's been so quick, I'm just going to take everybody's guesses from last round. Uh, let's see. Yeah, nobody guessed to full art. So, yeah. I know uh, Blaster guessed Venus or GX, but he didn't say the artwork. So I'm always assuming regular art, unless you say otherwise. Um, well, honestly, I don't like the colors. It looks low definition. That's what I'm saying. So we're gonna, we're gonna keep up with all the guesses since that was so quick. Let's move on, next pack. We have Venusaur that we're ready to, that we're ready to, uh, they're ready to build. It does, dude, I'm telling you, man, that the, the colors are kind of awkward in that card. I thought I was gonna look, maybe it's really pretty IRL and I just don't know. Um, but it's definitely an interesting card as far as the artwork goes. Hey, our first Jirachi, that's good. We need me a couple of these. Super, what's up, bro? Nice to see you, welcome to the chat. Uh, how many have we opened up so far? We've almost opened up 50. We're almost halfway done, guys. And we've op we've opened up quite a good amount of stuff. We This is definitely so much better than the last time we opened up packs. I have a theory. Oh, here's our first Pharisee. This is the one that won me a game versus uh, <laughs> that I got eight heads with. I hit 160 damage with Pharisee in one of my games in pre-release. That was really funny. Um, but I have a little theory. Apparently, every time I open... Oh, our first Judge's Whistle, too. That's good. Uh, every time I open up packs, as soon as they become available online, I always pull, like, absolute trash. But whenever I wait till the evening, I always pull pretty nicely. Thank you for the follow, Super. Welcome to Ore Bomb Industries. Welcome to the army. Welcome to the realm. How you doing? Thank you for joining us. Uh, so maybe, maybe on some big brain things right there, just give it a little bit of patience. You might pull some hot stuff. Um... Is a man give away IRL cards? No, I'm only doing the online codes, guys. I'll DM you a code if you win. I'm pretty sure I've said that multiple times, but it's all good. It's all good. Oh, Nine Tails. Love him. Love her. But it said new there, so how did I get it? How did I not get Maybe I got the reverse one. Um, Blastoise. I should build something with Blastoise. I just don't know what I would build besides, like, Waylord. That seems kind of boring. I played enough Waylord. I'm tired of Waylord. And Ferrothorn, there it is. Okay, this tech does 20 damage times the amount of metal energy attached to this Pokemon to one of your opponent's bench for one. So it's not to all of them. So it's just one, like I thought. You can't add more than 100 damage this way, but being able to hit 80 to the active and then 100 to the bench is kind of wild. Um, how do you set this up? I don't know, but maybe you can do like Nagan Adele energy switch shenanigans. I don't know, but it seems like a really cool, fun, like rogue deck idea that I definitely want to play around with. 
Do I crack some IRL packs or some Voodoo Spear Bomb energy shared energy magic? Magic. I'm telling you guys, the Aura Army has their hands in the air right now. Or did you go to Dallas? I did not go to Dallas. I, I let my friends sell my cards at Dallas, but let you guys know, couldn't afford Dallas. Um, things came up, took all my money. <laughs> but I managed to sell most of my cards, so I got a little bit of pocket change. And uh, with that little bit of pocket change, I can probably finish buying the cards I need for my decks so I can go to other tournaments. Oh, I got the reverse. Also, you could build a shrine version. A shrine version of Ferrothorn. That's cool, too. Uh, <clears throat> I built a Waylord and Laddie tag team deck. Interesting. It could show you my list for Blast. If you guys want to post your list, go. we have the Discord section where people do post their list, and I always look at them, so... Feel free to post them there. I might steal it one day. And with, of course... Oh, oh. <laughs> It's so cool. It's so cool. Oh my god, I hate seeing this because I'm still fighting in my head if I want to get the full art or the alternate art. Uh, I really need to get one of these for my for my Mimikyu, for my Malamar deck IRL, and I don't know which one to get. And this one looks so cool, and I love it. Oh, it's so cool. Who guessed this? Expanded Bronze Long Ferrothorn. Ooh, the spice. Uh, I know somebody guessed this, but I don't think they guessed the right artwork. Secret Rare Gengar, yeah, Mimikyu, uh, Wal Waluigi guessed the Secret Rare, but not the alternate art. <clears throat> Alright, well, it's been a while, so put new guesses in the chat, but look at this beautiful card. Two of my literal favorite Pokemon on the same card. They're up there in my top 20, I want to say. Maybe top 50, uh, but like they're up there. They're both up there. I've really, I really like Mimikyu since release, and Gengar's is one of my OG favorites. And to have them both on the same card that's actually playable, it makes me so happy. It makes me so happy. Uh, this get guesses for new cards that you guys want to see. Could you put your link to the Discord in chat? Somebody invite, somebody put the Discord in the chat, please. One of my lovely viewers. Hey, there it is, Nightbot coming through. Instaroar, <laughs> Incineroar. <laughs> All right. Look at all these people guessing. <clears throat> I'm going to say Nanu again. I feel like Waluigi is really funny today because she's been guessing things almost right every time, but not quite there. Oh my god, this card is gorgeous. I might have just convinced myself to get the alternate art. Hopefully we pull the full art so I can look at it. Um, but like, oh my god, it looks so nice. I've decided that no matter what, I'm getting the full art Snorlax. Oh, another Mr. Mime. Okay, we're just going to keep all the guesses from last time though since nobody gets Mr. Mime. Someone asked me, is the booster box giveaway IRL? Yeah, it's IRL. We're, we're literally mailing that one out to, to whoever wins it. Oh, yeah, alternate art uh, Waylord is in this set. They're the only one, the only alternate arts missing are Picaram, uh, Snorlax, and Venusaur. But the rest of the alternate arts are there, the other three. Um, All right, let's go, let's keep going. God, it looks so good. It looks so good. It, uh, I'm, I'm like still flabbergasted by how good that one looks. I mean, outside of Picaram, I think that's the best looking one. Like Waylord and Magikarp looks cool too. Uh, Snorlax just looks like garbage. Um, the Celebi Venus one looks kind of weird to me. I don't like the ankle. I don't like the gross sideways frog mouth that's going on. Alternate version of Waylord on my pre-release. Oh, that's so sick. I actually do want to give me some alternate art Waylords because I, I still play the expanded one. Uh, that's my one expanded deck I have built right now uh, because I'm switching over my Lucario deck to standard so I don't have that built already. But oh my God. <clears throat> I wish they make the Eevee the way that K-Lord did. Raise your hands, everyone. Synchro is telling you guys right now. Put those hands in the air. Hear that? That's charging up the aura bomb right now. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's charge the aura. Yeah. Thank you for the bit, Synchro, as always. And let's look at this Grimer. Uh, this deck is really more damage for each special condition affecting your opponent's type of Pokemon. So what does this pair well with? Like, obviously there's a, that, uh, what's it called, Salazzle, I guess. There's that other Alolan Muck, the GX one, right? Um, 
Kind of is the same thing. I don't know. It's interesting. B drill close enough. <laughs> All right. Let's open up another one. We're over halfway done. The pulls have been sweet to us tonight. Oh, man. I'm very happy. And Electrode and Pinsir. Electrode's kind of cool, actually. Nobody's really... I mean, people in Japan were playing this all the time when the set first came out. Using this combined with... Uh, uh, Pikaram setting up energies on the board, knocking the Dells and stuff like that, and just evolving into Electro, putting enough energies on a Pikaram and taking a GX knockout. But they stopped doing that because it ended up being bad. So our top uh, Parasect and the Hilego combo. I'll have to look at Parasect again. Uh, Alola Negi. So we have five Nidas. Okay, cool. I'll put some of those for trade. Oh, here's that new Tauros, right? Attack the 10 more damage reach damage count on all of your Tauros and Tauros GX. Play this for Shrine. <laughs> we might just build a Tauros deck, to be honest. No one need a Flart yet? Come on, I need to win. <laughs> like Red and the Lolan Golem could be cool. That could be cool, you are right. Uh, for sure. How many packs have you opened? Oh, we got Reverse Kabutops to go with all of our other friends. I think are roughly 55 now. Poison Sacks, they have both mucks in this set. That's interesting. 20 damage to confuse, po uh, to confuse Pokemon between turns. Oh, it's like a burn thing. Oh, that's interesting. And, oh, another one. Ugh, I don't want two. I don't even want one. <laughs> All right, guys. New guesses in the chat. Let's get it. <clears throat> and can one of my lovely people in the chat... Uh, I know nobody guessed this, by the way. I, I, I would have known if somebody guessed this one. Uh, but go ahead and get some new guesses in the chat. Would you would you mind playing a match against me, Orbom, with some tag team cards? I mean... For you, Eagle Heart, I will. I just don't want people thinking that I'm going to be playing a lot of games tonight. Because I don't actually want to be playing a lot of games tonight. I actually got some stuff to do. So I'll play like one game versus you. I'll like quickly throw together a deck or something. And we can play. Um, although, I'm not too sure. Because I do need to get some sleep early. Because I have school. I gotta take care of that stuff. Now get those guesses in, bro. Get those guesses in. Full Art Brock. Ooh, I really want a Full Art Brock. IRL. Because the link takes me to the app store. We'll download the app, bro. If not, uh, there the link to my Discord, the invite link to my Discord is in all my videos. So just go to a YouTube video and just click one, and uh, the link is there. I can't, I can't, I wouldn't invite you right now, but I, just because of my computer, I can't have too many things open at once. But all right, let's open up some other things. Incineroar GX. I hope I hope I pull Incineroar. I, I want to get at least three Incineroars. Uh, you can't say any art, though. That's cheating. Any art is cheating. I love this Articuno. This Articuno, the artwork is kind of cool. It's, like, super cool. And the ability is really strong, too. And the attack's really strong. This is a good addition to water decks. Moving on. Oh yeah, can somebody look up how much the full art Venusaur Celebi cost on as, well, as far as packs go on PCGO? Because I'm just going to put mine up for trade and try to get some more packs so we can do some trading and stuff like that. Pulled it yesterday. I don't think it's good, but it's definitely interesting. I think it's going to be really good when the next set comes out. So I just want to hold on to a couple so I have them ready for the next set. Oh, this is a hollow. This is the one that mills, right? Discard all fire energy from this Pokemon. Discard... Discard a card at the top of your opponent's deck for each energy you discard this way. I don't know how this is going to work in standard. Uh, but in expanded, it's just like blacksmith discard too. But that seems very inefficient. It just feels like a worse Durant. Can I trade you for that? For which one? The Venusaur? Should I should be able to open an Incineroar there. Okay, look at trades. Are you giving me more packs, bro? Outcast is to be announced for Full Art Celebi. Oh, the uh, the website. I mean, just just somebody go to the uh, go to the actual trade section and just type it up and see if they find something. We are sixty five. So yeah, we're sixty five packs deep. We got thirty five packs left to go after this one. Let's see if we can pull some juice. Some juice. I want to see what you guys guessed. I actually didn't look this time. Judge Whistle, Secret Rare. Um, Snorlax, Latios, Full Art Incineroar, Pokecom Secret Air, Full Art Brock, 
Latios, Latias, GX, assuming regular art. Need a full art. All right, cool. Let's see what you guys guessed. Arch wanted in the next three packs, you'll get Incineroar. Oh, this man is out here. He's just praising me. He's like, he's blessing me right now with his luck. We'll see. We'll see what happens. So he can't know until a week of pub trades. I mean, just, I mean, I, I mean, yeah, I agree with that. But I just want to know, like, what people are doing right now. Like, at this moment. Like, what's the low? I can find that out after trading, I guess. It's not a big deal. Let's see if we get that in in the next three pack, like Arch wanted said. And, okay, last pack. Let's see if we get it. I really want the alternate R Latios. We did not. We got another Executor, though. Paradise Draw and Egg Splat. Expanded fun. All right, let's pull something good. We got 30 packs left. Come on, I need some juice. He meant the next five, okay. All right, <laughs> All right next five packs for now. Let's see if we can get one. Uh, oh, another Cobalion. <laughs> I don't think anybody guessed Cobalion. Uh, so go ahead and put in your next guesses. What do you think the next Ultra Rare is going to be? How many... Donna, do we have? We have five. Looks like we have. It looks like we're about to get five of each. <sighs> so many judge whistles. <laughs> okay, judge whistle by Glade King, Morgan by Mass Meowth, and Cinnaror. I'm assuming if you don't give me an artwork, I'm just gonna assume you say regular art. Uh, just to keep that in mind. Snorlax. So Snorlax Eevee. Uh, alternate art Lottie. I really want them IRL, man. I hope those aren't going to be too expensive because they're not like great cards in standard, but at the same time, like they're Latios and Latias, so they're probably going to be expensive just based on the Pokemon that they are. So uh, I don't know. I, I need to get though, I need to get like one of each artwork for my collection though, because I, I have almost every Latios and Latias card that's ever been printed. I'm missing some of like the, I'm missing the star ones, the, the really expensive star ones, and some Delta versions. But other than that, I have almost every single one. And because I have school tomorrow, so I got to... No, you don't get to claim it. You don't claim it. Um, what happens with the booster box is we're not giving it away on Twitch. Uh, tomorrow, I'm going to pick a winner. I'm just going to literally randomize everything. I'm going to pick a winner, and I'll, I'll contact the person that wins. So make sure you follow me on Twitter, so it's the easiest way to contact you. And... Um, just keep track of your YouTube comments, man. Because I'm just going to respond to the comment section on one of my videos. Uh, ideally, though, I can contact you through Discord or something like that. So that's how we're going to do it. Anyways, looks like not enough people have guessed. Let's move on. <clears throat> Lycanroc. Lycanroc only comes as a regular in this set. Fun fact. I actually need two. I haven't pulled a single one yet. I need two of them, though. Uh, I'm worrying because I want one. <laughs> But now, but now it's my guess. <laughs> okay, then. That works. Uh, Pikachu Zekrom. There's our thing. And so Strike is just Lucario, but not Lucario. So it's not as cool. <laughs> I don't have Twitter. Get yourself a Twitter, guys. Get yourself a Twitter. Follow me on Twitter. Tweet at me on Twitter. It's also another entry for the box, guys. If you tweet at me, a screenshot of you guys, um, of you guys checking out the website. Tomorrow is the last day of the of the of the entries. Oh, speak of the devil! Somebody did say Lycanroc, and it was Antonio, my boy, out here winning. <laughs> Go ahead and just—I mean, Antonio, just offer yourself a trade for a pack. You're you already on. You already have me as a friend here, so just go ahead and do that. And uh, nice. Lycanroc. I actually want this card only because I'm like it's it's a really cool fin with the follow. Thank you for the follow, my dude. Uh, only because I like the energy disrupting aspect. I'm trying to rebuild Lucario for the new standard format, and being able to disrupt energy just seems kind of good right now. Uh, and more importantly, you have just a really decent GX attack. <clears throat> Splitter charge GX. I mean, it's just a nice one of GX attack you can easily use. I know how good it's going to be. I just want to play around with it to see if I actually like it, but. I definitely want to try to rebuild Lucario since this meta feels a little bit more focused on Lucario doing well. Uh, outside of Malamar, there's not many decks that can handle Lucario right now. Venusaur is another problem because you can't Oko Venusaur. You literally have to GX one time and then pray from there. <laughs> Alright, it discards an energy yeah, when you evolve from it. 
But hey guys, go ahead and put yourself another guess in the comments, in the chat, I mean. Look at the trades real quick. All right, I'll look at the trades while we wait for people to give me a guess. It's gonna do the stupid glitch that always happens. Oh, he just gave me Incineroar for a Veldum. <laughs> Much appreciated, Eagle Heart. I do appreciate it. I do want... I am trying to give me two so I can make a video out of it. Thank you so much, my dude. <clears throat> thank you, thank you. I don't know why I always go here. Well, I know why. It's because that's what I do for recording. Let's check out all these uh, entries. Um, Snorlax, Pokecom, Incineroar, Snorlax, Judge's Whistle, Nita, Ampharos, Picaram. That's a lot of trades. <laughs> Cobalion, I emailed the list. I just saw, bro. That's cheating though? What's cheating? What's cheating? Uh, if you don't give me an artwork, guys, I'm gonna assume you mean regular art. So if we do pull the card and it's not and it's not regular art, you don't get to win. I do apologize. Make sure you tell me the artwork if you want to guess a particular one. But we have 25 packs left. We're on the last quarter. We pulled pretty well. So let's see what we can do. Got to earn that Incineroar fair and square. You know, you're right. I'm not going to play the list unless I pull one. <laughs> Just kidding. That ain't happening. <laughs> if I don't pull one, I'm just trading for two. I have 100 extra packs, and I, I'm, they're here for trading. <laughs> they're here for get, to get me the cards that I need. I got to record a bunch of decks that I haven't uploaded to the channel yet. Um, so Incineroar is definitely one that I have not uploaded yet. <laughs> All right, Let's see if we can pull some more juicy juice. And nope. Plus, I'm gonna get a booster box soon from our lovely sponsors. By the way, this whole video is sponsored by Guardian Gaming. I don't know if you could tell by, you know, the logo being right here. But uh, thanks to them, we were able to get 100 packs for opening. And another Venusaur. <laughs> Well, I definitely have two extra full arts. If anybody wants to trade me for some full art Venusaur Selvies, uh, we're going to go ahead and continue with what you guys guessed last time. Yeah, we're going to continue with what you guys guessed last time because it was so short and I can still see them on my chat. They're not too far up. So we'll just continue on. No need to re-guess, guys. It's all good. And... I'm going to guess that there will be four more Ultra Rares in the remaining packs. What an absolute unit. Venusaur Selby is an absolute unit. <laughs> <clears throat> Alright. Make sure if you guys are trading me, all I need right now are packs. The, law, the team up packs. So, don't offer me things. Unless you're offering me things from the set that I do need. Um, oh, finally, Wonder Labyrinth. That's actually good. Or Wondrous Labyrinth now. Not Wonder Labyrinth. I don't know if I like a Wondrous Labyrinth. But the artwork on this card, I never really got a chance to sit down and look at it. It's kind of cool. I wish the artwork was a little bit bigger. It's kind of small. But it's a pretty broken card. That's why you guys got to make sure you have your counter stadiums in your deck. Because uh, these, these Prism cards are... These Prism stadiums are a little bit ridiculous. If you're going to trade for them, make sure you offer me some packs. I would greatly appreciate it. Or oh, first Lugia Full Art or Reverse. Lugia is just a cool Pokemon, man. What can I say? I really like Lugia. I wish he had better cards. <clears throat> this is a mystery treasure all over again. Oh my god, they grow like grass. <laughs> You're absolutely right. <gasps> oh my god, she's so gorgeous. I gotta get one of each of these girls, man. You know it would be like the coolest thing? I would love to roll up to a tournament. Playing Lati playing my Latios and Latias with the with the ladies in just like max rarity. Like just three alternate art Lati or just give me one of each artworks. Give me the uh, full art, alternate art, regular art, because I just like the artworks. And like give me three of each of these ladies, man. These ladies are really dope. I love these man. She's so kawaii dasu. <laughs> oh, God, I love it. Anyways, get some new guesses in the chat, guys. Did somebody guess that? Did you guess that, Mass Meowth? Or are you just screaming because you're feeling the same way I'm feeling? I don't think you guessed it. Yeah. Evelyn is the best hat girl. She is one. She is literally, I think she's my favorite, honestly. 
You guess the synchro? Let me see. Oh, Synchro did guess it. You know, actually, you did guess it, Synchro. Dude, that's awesome. You did guess it. Yeah, go ahead, bro. Offer me the trade. <laughs> Offer me the trade for a pack. Congratulations, man. That's wild. <laughs> Anyways, get some new guesses in the chat. My boy Synchro did guess it correctly. That's rad. All right, let's get some new guesses in the chat, guys. Dude, that's so dope. She's so gorgeous. Look at her, man. She's so cool. I really want one of each <laughs> online now. I mean, I don't need it, but I oh, have we pulled have we pulled do, do blades by the way, guys? I don't think I've seen any do blades yet, and I do want to. I was thinking that one of my first decks I should upload is probably gonna be um, do blade, whatever it's called, tool drop. Um, couldn't think of the name, but tool drop. I, I, we haven't uploaded tool drop yet. I know it's a very popular deck, but I don't remember if I pulled any dough blades. I'm gonna have to look at the next hone edge and check. Absol can't count you guys. Make sure you you check the. Uh, it's ultra rares only that you guess. We're down to the last twelve with this one. Counting this one. Can we pull some juice? Can we pull the goods? Full our Pikaram. Full our Pikaram. Do we we have three of them now, right? Alright, let's check the one edge. Have we pulled any dough blades? Um Oh no, we pulled four. I just haven't noticed. Okay, cool. Well that works. That's all I need is four. So that works out. How about the new Aegis Slash? Do we have any decent Aegis Slashes in the standard? Uh this tech takes 40 less damage uh from attacks. Okay, that's not bad. Uh, what about this one? When you post next door, if the defending Pokemon is damaged by an attack, it will be knocked out. Mm. These are old ones, right? Yeah, we can't use those. Alright, so we have this option and this option. This one's probably better. Um, with the ability. I'm just trying to think if you want to play Celebi in this deck. Remember we're about memory energy for the sweet tool drop with Aegislash? Memory energy? Yeah, I was thinking Celebi, personally. Uh, oh, we finally got Ampharos. Nobody, I don't think anybody gets Ampharos, but we finally have Ampharos now. That's good. That's one Ampharos that that we don't need. Now we just need two more. All right. Um, everyone get your guesses in again. But we have Ampharos. I actually really like Ampharos. Uh, is it tier one? I don't think so. I don't. I think it just gets outclassed by Picarum, but... Man, if it's not a cool ability and cool attack. It's just so hard to get those uh get those electro powers. Honestly, I'm thinking about playing this. I'm thinking about rebuilding my Ampharos deck and playing it with like four order pads that can help you get um cards like your electro powers and your rare candies and stuff like that. And just being able to attack with like power recharge over and over and over again just seems really good. That was my last list. Oh yeah, I just saw you emailed me. Did you guess it, Antonio? I don't think you did. Double check. G and M, Gengar Mimic. Oh, you guessed Gengar Mimic you that last time. That sucks, man. Um, plays four order pad flips, four tails. I mean, you can say all you want, but look at the uh, look at Wailor Magikarp, bro. I don't. And plus, it's an insta play card. I mean, it's it's this is the kind of deck where I feel like I would like to play it with four judges whistle, four order pads, and like. A bunch of like Volkners and stuff like that. I want to try. I want to try building it again. Like honestly, because I feel like it's so good. Like Impact Bolt's so strong. Electro GX is so mediocre and lame. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and do this again. I mean, hopefully, you guys got those guesses in. How many do we have left? Seven more after this. We're on the last few. What are we missing so far that we haven't, that we've opened, that we have not opened? Besides the dreaded, my favorite Pokemon, Latios and Latios, my favorite Pokemans up there. Top five. Um, 
it gets your rare candy. That's what I'm saying. It gets your rare candies, gets your, gets your, uh, whatever it's called, electro powers, gets you all sorts of stuff. How many Evelines? We have three regular arts. It's perfect. I know we have like a bunch of you. Um, let's see. We're almost there. Three more, four more after this. All right, three, two hot ladies, two hat ladies. <laughs> um, hat, hat, two. All right, guys, put your hands in the air because we're about to open our last pack after this. I want to feel. <gasps> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. <laughs> Is that the only one we have? We got. We didn't get a single other one. Oh, they come. Do they come in the pre-release kits? Because it's reverse, regular, and hollow. Hmm. Oh, look at this baby girl. You know what? At first, I was like, kind of like not feeling the Erica. Now that I'm seeing it, man, oh, I'm, I'm like, I'm blushing. I'm blushing. She's so cute. She's so cute. I love her. She's adorable. Guys, my birthday's coming up in uh, a month. If you guys want to give me early birthday gifts, I am open to Erica's Hospitalities, Secret Rare Metal Energies, um, Secret Rare Pokecoms. Need them. <laughs> Birthday is in a month, and I kind of want them now. So just letting you know that I'm in love, and I need at least two, three of these from Malamar to continue my Max Ready trend. But before, um, before we finish opening up the packs, I have, I think I have a. I hate this stupid. This is the. This is a glitch that's been around forever. Um, where is? I thought I had a team up. I thought I had a team up pre, uh, booster box thing. Um, hold on. I thought I did. I guess I don't. I, th oh, I was really looking for the pre-release kit because I thought I had it. Oh, whatever. Uh, let's check this trade real quick. Check trades for a gift. This man's, this man hooked me up. Dude, that's so rad. All right, that means a lot less trading I need to do. Now I don't have to find Lycanroc. That's one less instant. Oh my God, Eagle Heart, my boy. Look at the full heart, Nanu. Look at him. Look at this, look at this mad lad. Look at this mad lad. Uh, dude, thank you, Eagle Heart. I appreciate it, bro. This man out here getting packs. Sabrina, oh. It's just, this is like... It's so sad because I love her so much. Ah, dude, I'm so dude, I'm such a weeb. <laughs> why, why do you guys even watch me? I'm such a loser. <laughs> Thank you for the packs, my dude. Your packs aren't available for trading for the giveaway. Oh, that is my bad. Let me go ahead and fix that actually. Uh. Boop. There we go. And for the last pack, for at least today, is going to be one more Secret Rare Dangerous Drill. Well then, huh. this has been, uh, I think this has been pretty successful. I don't know about you guys, but I've been, I think it's been pretty successful. Uh, we're gonna, the rest of the stream is gonna be me trying to get more packs <laughs> so if you guys want to hang around feel free to but that's the end of the pack opening for now but we're probably gonna open up some more packs like to be honest you guys know how i am i can't help myself i see these packs i just want to open them um <laughs> give me one second eagle heart let me take care of some stuff first and then we can do a game i also don't have a deck built yet but i can actually play lucario versus you just for the sake of me trying out lucario we got some really let's go ahead and look over the polls actually while we're here uh, pokemon filter uh, team up and ultra rare I'll take that one one second bro all right supply let's see 
I should probably release that other screw to this thing. Boom. Apply. There we go. Alright, so this is what we pulled. What are we missing? We're missing... Oh, we didn't get any Absols. So we have to try to get Absols. We didn't get any Age of Slash. Um, we didn't get any Dragonites. We only got one Snorlax, which is fine. I mean, I'm, I'm not going to be playing any Snorlax-focused decks. Uh, we didn't get any Gyarados, no. I really wanted to play Gyarados. We missed all of our Lotties. Look how beautiful all the... Oh, even the Fall Art looks so good. Oh, my babies. My babies. This is the greatest alternate art of all time. Just, I don't care what anybody says. It's just the greatest one of all time. We didn't pull any of our babies. We're going to have to open up. We're going to have to talk to Guardians Gaming and get another 100 packs. Um, but I think we did pretty good there. Let's check the trainers. Oops. Uh, let's do team up. Boom. Apply. And let's see what we got. So this is what we got. What did we not get? We didn't get any bills. We didn't get Brock. We're missing Dan uh, Dana. Oh, she's so sassy. I love her. Uh, oh, you know what? Morgan is just... She just... I love class, man. Class is so attractive and... I love Morgan. Morgan's great. But she's fun. Look at her. She's so... Ooh, uh, the blonde is just killing me. I used to not like blondes, but now I'm just like all up into it. <laughs> we didn't get any uh, Ingo and Emmett, which I'm okay with. <laughs> I don't really need Ingo and Emmett. Uh, Alright, that's not too bad. And I don't think there's any secret energy, so this is all we care about right now. Alright, we didn't do bad at all. We did not do bad at all. Alright, so what do we have extras of? We want to get rid of these, because we don't need these. Um, I think that's it though, right? I mean, we have, I have one of everything else I need. Oh, we don't need this either. So we can get rid of Magikarp Waylord and we can get rid of, uh, we can get rid of, uh, Venusaur and Celebi, Full Arts. What is your green, what is your game name? It's Orbum. Uh, check, check in the, check in the panels down below, it'll tell you. I think it's, it's, I can never remember if it's AB or Bomb or or Bomb AB, but somebody will say it in the chat. <clears throat> You'll trade me whatever I need? Well, <laughs> everything I mentioned is what I need, so <laughs> if you want to hook a man up. Is regular, but do regular arts. I don't do full arts, or I don't do max rarity online. I stick to IRL for that stuff. Uh, for now, let's go ahead and get rid of these Venusaurs. Unless anybody wants them, you gotta let me know right away. Uh... Skateboard hair art. Congratulations, Antonio. Here's the pack. <clears throat> Inner weeb activated, activating pretty hard right now. That's what I'm saying, man. I don't get. I mean, this set is full of beautiful women. What can I say? Like, it's not. It's this is out of my control. All right, let's check. A, let's take a look at uh, Venus. Uh, let's do Celebi tag. I think that's how it works. Tag. Uh, so, you know, Celebi. Is that how it looks? Is that not how it works? I don't know. Cards, I am getting team up, apply, all right, whatever. Let me just type Venusaur. Um, so this dude's doing a straight up for one for one. That guy wants Erica. I'm just trying to look at like packs. So this one's going for like 11 packs-ish. I think I can do mine for 10 packs. The pull rates are really good, honestly. Eight packs. Oh, this guy's only doing eight packs, so we should probably be below that then. We can do seven packs. Probably. I think seven packs looks pretty decent. Uh, that feels like it'll get traded quickly. If anybody wants to trade, feel free to offer me the trade. Let me know. Uh, just add me. King Cooler. What's up, King Cooler? Uh... Okay, then, so we know there are about seven packs. Let's check Waylord Magikarp. Or Magikarp Waylord, I guess. All right, so the Far is going for about six packs, which means the Hyper is probably going for about, yeah. So they're both going to be seven packs apiece. So it's actually kind of low. I'm actually pretty surprised. Maybe it's because, like, the day is running around. I can give team-up packs to you for the Far Erica Hospitality. Uh, God. I mean, I'll do it just because it's you, UK. But, man, I really wanted to keep it. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Uh, it's going for so many packs though 40 packs here um, 
And these are like four packs a piece. We're gonna need at least three of them. Ah, oh, it's so beautiful, but I definitely don't think I need it. That was only 20 packs. Uh, is there anything else that's like high numbers so I can like, get a rough estimate? Because that's quite the difference between 40 and 20. 25, 26. Honestly, debating on just getting this, just getting this other full art. <laughs> Sell it now for a lot of packs and then trade for it later. I think it's just gonna go up though, honestly. You looking for a full art selfie Venusaur? No, I have two extra that I'm trying to get rid of, actually. Uh, go 20 packs, you will sell it for the Erica. Any mini UK if you wanna work something out. Do you have any regular art Erica's uh, mini? If you do, let me know, because I actually do need some regular arts as well. Um, <clears throat> I can get rid of these hat ladies too, I guess, since I don't think I'll need them. But before I close this out, does anybody, anybody here looking for, uh, can I accept? All right, cool. Anybody here looking to trade the Hyper Rare Magic Arb Waylord or the two Full Art Venus or Celebes, they're all going for seven, seven packs a card. Anybody here want to grab one? Let me know before I actually start posting these because I want to make sure that I cater you guys first. Um, so I'm trying to sell them one pack lower than what I'm seeing as the lowest. I have no Erica's because I'm scared to open packs. That's fair. Uh, I can get Erica's though. So like, if you want to actually do the trade only because you're, only because you're my dude, I'll be willing to do it for like 20 packs. That seems to be what people are doing to lowball, so. It's only because you're my dude. Um, all right, so yes, no, maybe, let me know. So I'm just gonna post them now. I'm also gonna, before I post them, I'm gonna check, uh, I'm gonna check what I have real quick as far as the fire trainers go. Like I don't need these dangerous drills for sure. I don't need any of these secret rare cards. Um, yep, I do it me. Alright, dude, um, add me as a friend and uh, offer me a trade, bro. <clears throat> what do we have that we don't need? I have three extra black, two extra black markets. And I want to, I want to keep the Jasmine. Because I'm probably never going to play more than one of anyways, so it would be nice to keep that around. I want to keep the cards that were given to me. So Nanu and Sabrina, I'm going to keep... Um, so my only extra trades is uh, is Evelyn and Dangerous Drill. All right, it's easy enough. And Black Market, I guess. How many acts? I'm seven packs for the Hyper Rare. God, I need to go soon. All right, let's check a look here. So, Dane, let's just do that. How about that? I am getting team up, seeker rare, apply. Dangerous drill, three packs, <laughs> nothing. All right, I guess I'll do these for three packs then. I'll probably do the two for five packs, to be honest. I didn't realize how many of the L birds are in this set looking crispy. Oh, the legendary birds? Do we have Lugia? I don't know if we have a hoe, but I know we have Lugia and the three legendary birds, and they're all they're all pretty good for in their own right. Once again, I said the full art, and I said I'm only trading them for the packs. So gotta yeah, decline this one, my dude. Sorry about that. Uh, speaking of which. Let's untrade that because I need to keep three. I just don't want the full arts. Look at all these followers, dude. Thank you so much for following, guys. R. Earl Grant and King Cooler. Thank you guys for following. Hoes in this set. That's a shame. They really missed an opportunity there to just put all the legendary birds in the set. Um, all right, so I'm assuming nobody wants them, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, throw them into the trades. Uh, boom. I am not, this is not what I'm getting. Uh, packs. 
No, no, it's thunder. What do you mean no items? Oh, it's team up. That's right. Never mind. Um, I am getting seven. I'm still looking up your name. Oh, right now I'm doing the Waylord because I don't think anybody wants the Waylord. <clears throat> Check tab. Oh, this tab. Ah, I got you. Um, I don't think anybody wants a waylord, so I'm gonna go ahead and post the waylord. And boom. Let's see if I have enough space. I did remove a lot of people, so there should be plenty of space. And then turn off the filters. Boom. Did you take a pack for your two Moltres? Do I have two? Uh, I want to keep the Moltreses only because only because I need to make sure I have them. Like, if I have extras of anything, feel free to take a look at them. Um, but anything that I don't have a four of count, for the most part, I'm probably going to hold on to for the time being. All right. But speaking of this uh, mini, are you going? Are you still here, bro? Because if you're still here. If you want to still do the Erica, let me know. If not, that's fine. Uh, just let me know. Leafeon for Lycanroc. I don't need Leafeon, bro. I have six. Please don't offer me trades. <laughs> uh, please do not spam offer me trades, guys. That's how I remove friends. Um, and like I always say, don't give me Pokemon cards uh, unless you're giving me gifts. That's different. But please do not offer me trades for things. Uh, I will I will always take a look at packs seriously because you know packs are how I make a living <laughs> But other than that don't offer me trades as far as this goes Eagle um, Eagle heart if you're still here We can play around I'm Trying to remember what oh, yeah, I have put in one of these uh, Eagle we can play here in a second I was double checking to make sure anybody wants to offer me a trade on the Venusaur so let me know because I am about to Call this a stream relatively soon. And by the way, thank you, SYD, for the follow. I don't know, man. I just feel like this deck is not going to work. Anyways, let's go ahead and start posting trades here. Um, I'll continue posting trades, I should say. I'm here, but I see it in trade for 19, but I'll send 20 for you to throw back one black market, possibly. Yeah, I can do that. Okay, that works. What is this? Oh, it's my trade. Um, all right, let's make it. Let's create some new trades. Public trade. Um, can we find it? There we go. Just three. Maybe I can do two. I could probably, you know what I'll do? I'll do five for two. How about that? That feels like it'll be easy to get rid of filters. Dane. Yeah, five for two seems pretty easy. I'm getting, I am giving, boom. 24 hours. All right. I need to give me Erica's, so I'll probably grab some Erica's while I'm here. I need to just, I need to think about the cards I need to find. Like I need to find Absol. Uh, Evelyn was the other one I had. Is nobody trading codes for Evelyn? Give me one second, Eagleheart. Almost done. Almost done. So Evelyn Floor is only going for one pack? Is that what's going on here? Uh, cards, I am... Oh, I forgot to do this, huh? Um, apply. Oh, Mask Meowth, you want it? Uh, looking like three packs. So oh, maybe not. <laughs> oh, this is for the whole... Oh, my God. The whole set plus the Steven. <laughs> That man out here. Um, let's try to find a legitimate one. This one looks like. Can we? Can we stop? Can we stop with all the movement? Um, I just want Evelyn by herself. Cards. Boom. Apply. That might help a little bit. Hmm. 
This guy's doing it for six, but the guy next to him, right below him, was doing it for three. Um, Mass Meowth, we can do three. I mean, three's kind of super low, but I mean, this dude's doing it for three, so we can do three if you want to do three. Have to make it for trade so I can send it. Oh yeah, my bad. Let me actually let me actually start putting these cards for trade now that I'm looking at it. Alright, so Mass Meowth wants the Evelyn, so I can give that to him. Let me make these for trade. Um God, she's so gorgeous, man. Uh trade here. Let's do the Erica for trade. Let me check the trades that we had earlier. <clears throat> Offers to me. We did the dangerous drills. Evelyn is the only other trainer card we needed. I am getting Mega Hound too. <laughs> Thank you, bro. I, I I guess I don't own a full art Mega Hound Doom, so that's pretty cool. Thank you, man. I appreciate it. SYD, shout out to you, big dog. Um, Alright, and the last thing that we had to trade was our Venusaurs. It looks like nobody cares about the Venusaurs, so I'm going to go ahead and do those real quick. Uh, what does Absol do? It increases the retreat cost of your opponent's Pokemon. Um, basic Pokemon by one. So it's really good. It's good for stopping Jirachi. That's the main reason why it's good. Um, <laughs> trade. All right, let's do the Venusaurs. Oh, somebody offered me a trade. Hold on. Let me check <laughs> before I actually do anything else. Uh, oh, this guy. Oh, yeah. Um, unfortunately, like I said earlier, I can only accept packs. I can't accept Pokemon cards. So we're going to have to reject this. Um... Okay, all right, let's see what's going on here. Five pack. oh, thank you, Mass Meowth, I appreciate it, bro. Yes, thank you, sir, much appreciated. And this man is getting black marked for 20 packs, much appreciated, guys. I do, I do, I do, I do appreciate it. All right. Um, check tab. All right, thank you, guys. Now, um, we gotta do Venus for Selby's. Should I do both of them? I think I'll just. I think I'll just put them up for seven apiece. Honestly, create trade, public trade. Um, I am getting packs. I wish I could like this was faster. Like if you could do like presets or something like that. Uh, team up. It's alright, man. It's not a big deal. Uh, for one. Done. 24 hours. And let's do it again. Create trade. Public. Team up that. Oh God, I really can't wait to give me those Erica's IRL. But I'm not gonna I'm not gonna purchase any cards until after I get my booster box. Gonna open that up for you guys on camera. That way I know exactly what I need. I don't want to spend any extra money I don't have to. Um, my buddy Steven has Snorlax. <clears throat> this is Snorlax EV Full Art, so I'm gonna try to grab that off of him, as well as a Lycanroc, and then Waluigi, I think her mother has a Lycanroc. So I'm gonna try to grab that off of her. Uh, so the only thing I need now is the really expensive stuff. So, but we're gonna start with uh, with Erica, and then we're gonna slowly get Pokecoms because I don't even know if I want to play Lucario yet because I have to continue testing it first. Um, but Eagle, now I think I'm ready. I'm pretty sure I'm ready now. This is a deck I definitely want to be sitting down and testing. So we might see streams of instead of you know newer stuff. I feel like I've uploaded plenty of new stuff in the past few days. We can do we can do some updated decks that I really want to play. Alright, where you at Lucario? Let's give it a try. It's been a long time since I played Lucario on standard. Are you gonna stream the booster box? I'm gonna record it. I don't think I'll be able to stream actually I might be able to stream it. The problem is I need to figure out how I can stream from my phone. I need to connect my phone to my computer stream from there because I don't have I can't put like a layout and stuff I don't know how I would do that 
Ray girls with hats decks is kind of bad. Dude, you can't play with Rayquaza. You gotta play it with Latios and Latias. That's the best way to play it. Because you have access to that really strong GX attack that makes you immune as well. For such a low cost. Uh, this hand sucks. Oh, I don't even check if I have Rescue Stretcher in this deck. <laughs> don't think I do. I think I had to put some Rescue Stretchers in here. We're going first, so that's not too bad. And we're playing against Rayquaza. Hmm. This hand's like not good. I guess Rayquaza, what do we do? <clears throat> I mean, he has the possibility of attacking us turn one, which kind of sucks. Uh, I really want to keep this around. Let's drop you. Hmm. We hit, how much damage do we hit again? 120, 140, 170. So we kind of need this to stick. I guess we have to drop you. <clears throat> Only trying to thin my hand down so I can play Lele. Uh, Lily, I mean. Alright, cool. I need at least two of these down just to be safe. And this is a pretty okay turn one. I hate that I dropped what I had to drop. But it is what it is. I don't even know. I don't remember what's in this deck anymore. I just built it earlier, but I don't remember. I, did I put the pow pad in? I guess I didn't. It's a very simple deck, which is nice. Lots of Pokemon, which is good as well. Um, all right. All right, let's do this. Lily for six. <coughs> okay. We got some pretty okay stuff. Uh... Hmm. I could play this now. I kind of like the idea of playing it now. Oh, we whiffed. It's fine. No biggie there. Can he attack me turn one with Coco Prism? I don't think he can. Yeah, I don't think there's a way, unless he also plays Energy Switch, which if that's the case, that's just cheating. And we don't like cheaters out here. I would just pass like this. Hopefully Lycanroc comes play it comes through too. Slowly slowing down my opponent slightly. He's playing Vicaray. Okay, so he's just playing Vicaray with the uh, new Top of Coco and all these nice new beautiful cards. But this will be my one game, and then we gotta call it a stream. But I do appreciate you guys all for coming out tonight. It has been lots of fun. We opened up a lot of good stuff. Lots of good stuff, honestly. Like, this is the first time I feel like I opened up, and the awesome gifts from the awesome viewers as well, Eagle Heart coming through. Uh, the generosity of people like Mass Meowth and. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. Oh, anyways. Alright, so we got a really good turn one here. Well, he has Wonder Labyrinth, though, which is kind of annoying. Uh, we have to try to find Brooklet, I guess. Um. Do I draw off this and play this stone? Because we need to find another energy if we're going to attack this turn. I completely forgot about the Wonder Labyrinth. It's such a strong stadium. This is why we play our counter stadiums, guys. Um, we don't actually take a knockout here anyways. I do draw the most if I can land this Lily. Super scoop up? No. All right, we'll just draw five here. All right, we got our Brooklet, which is good. We can disrupt this energy, which is also really good. Um... Kind of makes it easier for us to attack. Plus, like, this GX attack is pretty good in this matchup. We definitely want to play that down. We'll go ahead and get ourselves a Diancy. Do I want to pull anything up? Not really. I mean, I could knock this out and stop him from ever using it. But slowing him down is really good, too. So we're going to go ahead and just slow him down here. And we'll just attach the energy here, too. I kind of wish I didn't I'd play that card down, but we have Super Scoop up still, so we should be okay. Uh, do I hold on to this energy? Cyclone Click does one does 180, right? So if we get one more energy card, we can start taking knockouts. So that's pretty cool. All right, War Strike. Not enough, but kind of close. This is, what, this is the one thing this deck is missing, I think, is just the ability to take knockouts. Oh, guess what? Tell me, Antonio. 
Honestly, I'm thinking the ray. Okay. Uh, because, like, this deck is really, like, it only hits 170, which sucks. I mean, obviously, it's really good versus Picaram. It's really good versus uh, a lot of non-GX decks, actually, because you hit that 120 number uh, with Diancy's 140. So even things like Zapdos get knocked out if you have a Diancy down. Uh, but you're still 10 short from being, like, super relevant. Uh, if only we had cards like Red Rock back in format. They finally fixed Deluge after Dallas. Oh, nice. <laughs> oh, they did. Oh, they fixed the Deluge on PCGO. That's funny. <laughs> There's Tempest, so we get to take a free knockout here. Um, chances of him being able to set up a really good turn two, though, are very unlikely. Yeah, we can just uh, get down another. Am I playing four? Do I actually have two prized? Interesting. Um, it looks like I can maybe take out a Ranguru from this deck because I don't think I'll ever have bench space for a Ranguru. So I'm going to need to have at least two Riolus. Uh, interesting. I don't know how I feel about this. Start attaching here? Probably. I could super scoop up. Yeah, because I can super scoop up, actually, I'm just going to attach here for the time being. Uh, I won't scoop up yet, but the option is there. Oh, where's my chat? Let me check my chat. Oh, here it is. Hold on. I need to pull it up on my phone. They fixed Sylvalli memory. What happened with Sylvalli memories? I don't remember. Update me, guys. I, I don't. I don't. I don't even know Sylvalli was messed up. All right, there is the uh, boy. So we have access to a GX attack. Um. Hmm. Maybe counter gain is a little bit too cute and unnecessary in this deck, but counter gain like putting a counter gain on a Lycanroc just feels really strong. <clears throat> so Vigavolt into Tapu Koko Prism is really good as well because he can just get an attack off here. It won't be a knockout, which gives us time to GX, but it's still a pretty strong hit. With Koko Prism, he's still short though. Why is my chat now staying up on screen? It's weird. Oh. Do I have to reset it? I think I might have to reset my Twitch. Let me reset my Twitch, guys. Uh... Not like the actual stream, just just my my thing. They don't work on PCGO? Well, hopefully they work because I want to be playing Soul Valley. I'm really excited to be playing Soul Valley again. Sounds pretty good. Uh, oh, there's the big boy. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, is that? No, no, he's just short. If he gets Choice Band, though, he gets the knockout, which is kind of scary. If he gets another Rare Candy Vicavolt, this man just blew me up in one turn. This turns off, this turns off tools, but luckily for us, we don't need it. Uh, I guess we just start attaching to a thing so we can... Is that necessary? Actually, I feel like I just that was a misplay. That was completely unnecessary. We don't take a knockout here because of our because of the stadium. <laughs> That's really funny, actually. Uh, hmm. Oh, well. I guess this is why our GX attack this game. I guess these kind, these kind of attacks are really only useful against decks that can Oko consistently. So I gotta focus these GX attacks on those. But he can knock us out with Lele, and then we can actually knock out Lele if we can bump the stadium. I know we play three Brooklyn, so we gotta find it. Got, we gotta find one. Oh, I see what happened. My internet's disconnected. Fixed it. Um, they did. That's good. By the way, guys, don't forget if you're new here and you want to support the channel, don't forget to hit the follow, follow, subscribe if you really want to support me. We're, I think we're, we were almost at, I want to try to hit 50 subscribers soon. We hit 20 at some point, but I think we're down to 15 because I wasn't streaming as much. Um, but subscriptions are always appreciated. Donations to help me pay for food and stuff is always appreciated as well. <laughs> All right, so he doesn't have any requests down. Uh, this is his last GX, and I'm surprised he's attacking with it because I just win if I bump the stadium. I can also, hmm. I can't bench any of these dudes. I 
This is super risky. Regardless, we can hit for at least some damage. But I can't bench anything that isn't Riolu right now. So ideally, we can find our last... I mean, we have two Brooklets left in the deck. It's a 30-card deck, though, so I don't know how consistently... Oh, there it is. All right, so we just win. So well played, bro. Well, the deck is flowing nicely, at the very least. Like, it's doing what we wanted to do. We didn't use Pokecom at all that game, but Pokecom is just another consistency card. Um, so I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing that we didn't play it. And we just remove the Guardian Gaming logo off the screen now. Yeah, the deck flowed pretty nicely. Uh, I'm just trying to think, like, how useful the Lycanroc is really going to be. Because we might only need to play one. I don't think I, I don't think I need to play two. We do play the four four line though. Uh, maybe I need three Lucarios. Um, like what deck is a Lycanroc good against? We need to just have like an introspective of every good deck in the meta. We might do. How would you guys like a discussion stream where we just sit down, we make a chart of every deck that's in the meta currently, um, and we can use that to like kind of. It's really it's pretty okay versus Venusaur. The problem is if you put it down, it just gets okayed by Venusaur if they play Guzma, and it's kind of like, like it's already a kind of a bad matchup just in general. What are your thoughts on Glaceon? We uploaded the video of Glaceon Almost I like Glaceon a lot. What's up, Omega Bro? Nice to see you guys. I kind of like Kakui. I might increase my Kakui count. Um, the Super Scoop Ups, I always like playing Super Scoop Up, even though it's frustrating to play sometimes. If you need anything on PC Joe, just email me. Thanks, bro. Um, speaking of which, we should probably get the cards that we need right now um, before I end the stream. I do need to send the stream, though. Uh, <laughs> let's go ahead and get our Erika's. We need to get at least three Erika's. So if we can just trade for everything that we need right now, we can open up the rest of our packs later. So, let's see if we can find some good stuff. Please, no full arts. I do not want any full arts. Oh, we need to get two more Jirachis, too. All right, so let's make a list, guys. I know we need Absol. Let me know, uh, remind me while I'm typing out this list of all the things I need. Um, I know I need two Jirachis. I need three Erika, because I don't think I'm ever going to play four in a deck. Jirachi, two. Erica, three. We have our Picaroms. We have our uh, Venusaurs. We need one more Incineroar. Incineroar. And we need two more Ampharos. Amphi, two. Ideally, we have three, but we, have, we just need two more for the time being. So this one's going for only two packs. That's good. Two packs is good packs. Is anybody giving me like a bunch of them for like a really cheap price? If I can get them in bulk, that'd be nice. Uh, doesn't look like it. What are you, what are you guys saying? Uh, you have to go in to put the number of the card to search for it easier. Yeah, you're right. But I'm lazy. All right, so that one dude is selling it for two packs. I might have to grab that. Or, yeah, looks like there's a couple people selling it for two packs. I'm just looking to see if anybody has like three at a time, like four at a time, that kind of thing like this one. Oh, they're just cheating me. They're playing with my emotions. Yeah. People are just playing with my emotions. Oh, well, it's just easier for me to get the ones that are cheap. So let me go ahead and do that. This one's doing it for some Lost Thunder packs. I did get some Lost Thunder packs specifically because I gotta make sure they're all the same thing. So we gotta make sure we get three hollows. Otherwise, I'll ruin my OCD. I did put in a bunch of bunch of Lost Thunder because of like potential trades. What other cards do you guys think we need? We need the Absol as well. Just a one of Absol. We got the Mr. Mayim. Um, we have the fossils that we need. What other trainers should we get? Two packs again. Yeah, just grab one of the two packers. This is hollow, dope. All right, just one more of these and we should be set. 
and hopefully we don't open too many because if we do we can just give them away i guess but uh, i want to do this now so i know i'm comfortable opening up opening up the rest of the packs oh gyarados i need gyarados you're right gyarados gyarados i want four gyarados so i don't have any <clears throat> I actually really like playing Gyarados, but Gyarados is not like a huge rush. It's just something I eventually want to get. Gengar. I have my one Gengar. I don't think I'm gonna play more than one in my decks, to be honest. Do I have any Moltres? I'll have to double check my Moltres. And we need one more Erica, so hopefully one shows up. That's only one, two packs. Um. Oh, here's one. Not you. Uh, oh. Oh. <laughs> About to say, what's going on? Um, two packs, perfect. All right, so Erica's are done. What else do I need from this set? If you guys can remember. The ability of the confusion on the first attack can hurt Lucario. Yes, it can hurt Lucario real bad, but luckily they can just Acerola, right? Or Super Scoop up if they can land it. Um, I'm thinking about playing Palpad, to be honest, because I really want to play my supporters over and over again. Alright, so we're done with Erica. Yeah, that's what I said so far. I'm just trying to think about other cards I might need. Uh, I'll check in a second. Uh, you know, we don't have any Charizards either, because I think I do want to play Charizard. Let's, take a, let's look up Charizard. I don't have any of the Charizards yet. Uh, five lost thunder doesn't seem too bad. Sure, we can do that. What what version is this? The hollow one? No, it's just the regular. Is doesn't it come in a hollow? Does it not come in a hollow? I guess not. Looks like it's just a regular. How do how did we whiff that many regular rares of Charizards? If that's the case, there's a reverse one. Is that really the case? Yeah, they're not hollow. Huh. Interesting. Uh, well, whatever. Um, you got a promo. I don't care about the promos, honestly. Uh, stadiums. Do I have all the stadiums? I think I have all the stadiums. All right. So this was only one team up pack. Where's the one that was five lost thunders? Anything that's like not team up is good in my in my book. Um, I know there's one that had five lost thunders. Here it is. Uh, we'll do that one. I have like 20 more Lost Thunder codes in my backpack too. Um, okay, we need to get... Should we get four? I think we should get four. There's a, there, I know there was a few that was like only one pack. I think there was only one that was only one pack. Let's hopefully we can find it. What other rares are in this set that I can't remember? Here it is. And the rest of them are going to be like two packs a piece. Not too bad. There's another one that's only one pack. Come here. Come here, child. Hopefully this one works. It might be the same one I did last time. Oh, no, it does work. That's cool. Um, have You have your set of Pokecoms. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I have my old artworks too, just in case. Um, okay, this last one that we can grab with just two coats. Not a big deal. All right. Judge Whistle, I have plenty of Judge Whistles. Um, okay, so Charizard's done. Let's check Jirachi. We're going to need at least two more of those. I personally don't agree with playing four. I think three is fine. <clears throat> I know you want to lead with it, quote-unquote, but like you play the escape boards and the switches. You don't care if you lead with it. All you care about is having them in the deck. Super Couch, let me check this trade real quick. Oh, my last, the last Incineroar I need. Okay, thank you, man. I appreciate... Oh, okay. I'm going to do this. If anybody has a Breakpoint pack, let me know. Because I'm still trying to collect the packs. So I want one of each pack. Um, but I'll do this. Oh, Bill's Analysis. You are right. I do need to give me some Bills. Um, remind me to get Bills after Jirachi. I have my Coco Prism, but I definitely need my Bills. Um, I really like Bill. I, I definitely want to get me four of those. Um, is there any other trades? Like, Why is it just flashing Jirachi over and over again? 
Come on. There we go. Eight packs a piece, man. That's ridiculous. Why not collect locked packs? Um, I don't know. I never really thought about it. I think the lock just looks ugly, so I don't collect lock packs anymore. Or ever, for that matter. Looks like eight is the low end. That's ridiculous, man. What is this? Not you. Yeah, well, there's one for seven. Uh, there's another one for seven. We might have to just go for the seven pack ones, honestly. That's ridiculous. We only need two, so it's not too bad. I mean, like, you can tell me not to pay Apex for the card, but, like, it's part of being the YouTuber, man. You gotta get these cards right away, even if they are ridiculously overpriced. I'm doing seven. I'm not seeing anything below seven. We've been streaming for a long time. No wonder why my throat feels like it's burning out. <clears throat> my inner cheap skate is crying. Dude, I hate it too, man. <laughs> You're seeing it. I'm living it. <laughs> uh, yeah, but seven looks like the low end. So, oh, there's one for five, maybe. Oh, other Drachi. Full Art Waylord, though. That's pretty cool. Um, that's so sad. All right, Mr. Seven. Your boy is back. What's up, Genesis boy? It's been a minute. How you doing, big dog? Now, we're just right now trying to fin- um, Ooh, that's the reverse. No unmatching artworks here, please, and thank you. Um, wait a minute, what? No, don't do this to me. Don't tell me the only one that's seven packs is unmatching. Please. Oh, thank God. All right, cool. We're just trying to clean up and make sure that we have all the important cards in our set. Speaking of which, Zapdos. We didn't pull a single Zapdos. No, actually, we only pulled one Zapdos, so it was a reverse. Um, God, Zapdos are so expensive, too. Yeah, hopefully somebody has some good Zapdos for trade. And Rachi. You have Bill's Analysis? Okay, trade me for Bill's Analysis, bro. I have to double-check how many packs there are cars. I don't think they'll cost me too- they'll cost too much. Can I, like- can- can somebody- can somebody show me Zapdos trades, please? I'll check- I'll check Bill's here in a second. But I already got my Rachi, so you're just a second too late there. Alright, again, Zapdos- and this one I think I need four of, to be honest. Ooh, but this guy's doing reverse. Okay, if we're lucky- we can find three reverse Zapdos. <laughs> if we get lucky. <laughs> Unless it's cheaper to get four regular non-reverses. Oh, these are cheaper. Much cheaper. So in 14, 21, as opposed to 5, 10, 15, 20. I guess technically, yeah. It'd be cheaper to get, like, if they were all five packs, it'd be cheaper to get um, the non-reverses. Yeah, that sucks. Oh well. This is only four packs too. Come here, come here, come here. Yeah, <laughs> it's much cheaper. We're just gonna get these, I think. I will try to find some that are like only four packs a piece. Looks like there's plenty right now. Maybe we'll get lucky and there'll be less. Although I doubt it. Looks like four is the low end. I will get the ones that, ooh, this one's reverse. Oh, that's so painful. Okay, hold on. We found one that's reverse, that's four packs. I don't like doing reverses either. To be honest, looks like there's a couple reverse ones here. Okay, I'm just gonna just gonna four eight plus seven fifteen four eight twelve sixteen. Yeah, okay. We're just gonna get the reverses then. Looks like we're able to find a few that are four packs for reverses. I put the wrong nine tails in my deck and didn't even notice till the ability didn't work. <laughs> big yikes! That's a uh, big old yike of runes, my dude. Hey, be my man. It's been a minute, David, bro. David, how you been, man? What's good? How you, dude? How are you? It's been a long time. What's going on in life? I guess it's been like a long time in internet years. <laughs> I right, show me some more reverses. Uh, they were for like three packs. I know there was one of them. Another one that was only four packs. Uh, so we got to find that one. I gave you a trade. I'll check that out. One second. This one's only five. You might just do that one. I'll double check to see if there's any more threes. Um, or fours, I mean. Uh, oh, this one comes with the promo. That's really cool. All 
All right, this is four. All right, you gotta check one more thing. And then we gotta check bills. I'm good, just working and doing family stuff. Nothing exciting, but all good. Hey man, if life is nice and relaxing and chill, that's about as exciting as you can get, man. At least for me. What's up, phony? Gotta get one more Zapdos. Unfortunately, we had to get them all reverses, which is gonna irk me because I don't like the way reverses look. But <clears throat> I'll check this trade just in case, actually, because there might be something. Oh, Bill's analysis for a Greninja break. Oh, I can't give you that, bro. I only own three. I'm sorry. I want to give it to you. I really do, but I need to make sure I have at least three in my account. What is this? Hair cost for choice band. That seems super awkward, but if you need a choice band, here you go. <laughs> You got a Pikachu Zekrom deck? That's good. Uh, we pulled two, right? I don't think I want to play three in a deck, to be honest. Um, I just got to get one more reverse, and then we can move on to Bills. Then we have to get our small one-ups, right? So we got to get... We don't need Incineroar anymore. Uh, we don't need Erika. We just got our Jirachis. We just need Gyarados, Absol, and Ampharos. Is there any other GX cards in this set I think we, we, we might need? I don't think so. I think it's everything. I hope we get lucky. <clears throat> and we find one more reverse for only four packs. And then we'll probably open up like 10 more packs in the stream, right? It seems like fun. Um, let's see. I just have to check bills. Ready to go. Just need one more reverse. Hook a man up. Give me the juice. Give me the juice. I want the juice. I'm thirsty for juice. I like juice. My favorite juice? Probably apple juice. It's not true. I actually don't know what my favorite juice is. I never really thought about it. Juice is just good, man. Uh, I don't think we'll be able to find one. It's very sad. Keep looking. Maybe we'll get lucky. We just need one more reverse, and we will have matching artworks, and my OCD will be pleased. Uh, I guess I just look at the f four packs now, or this one. I know, I know there was one that was only five packs um, for the reverse, so we'll keep looking. I'm thinking team up needs it. Yeah, I think so too. I'm thinking about getting Nine Tails soon. Because of like the because of the fact that the, the price should probably go down. All right, let me check bills and then I'll check the trade. What do you mean the current bill is a card? Cards I am getting standard. It's not a new team up. It's it's bill is a card, right? Bill is definitely a card in this set. There we go. Uh, three packs for one. Not super high. Looking like three packs for the hot because it's a hollow man. Why are these cards hollows? Oh, I need to get Bill full art. Speaking of full arts, I want to get IRL. I really like Bill. I think Bill's a really good card. And I want to get them while they roll their cheap. Uh, looks like three. I want to get four, so that's 12 packs. Right, let me check this trade real quick. I'll get back to it. For a Froki. Oh, I can do this. Thank you, bro. Look at this man. Super, super couch. Is that how you say your name? Super couch. Thank you for being so kind, so generous today. I always toggle raspberry lemonade juice is real good. Ooh, that's real good. Raspberry lemonade is super good. I like I just like lemonade, man. I always toggle acceptable trade on and off to start load trades for me. That's what I've been trying to do. Um, but like, what's this? Oh, for Evelyn. The baby girl. Look at her. Um, anyways. We just need three more bills. So it looks like, it, yeah, it's, it's literally looking like the only ones are on for trade for our, um, are for three packs a piece. So we'll just grab one of these, I guess. <clears throat> we got one, we need two more. No, oh, that's two. Now we need two more. It is Koch or Chach. Oh, but just call me Super. Cool, I like Super anyways. Chach. Super Chach.
Oh, my throat is giving out. <laughs> my God. Uh, Bills number three. I can't wait to play. Bills is super good in like fossil decks, I think. Black Market looks dope online. I know, right? Black Market's super clean. It's a good card, man. I hate it. I hate it because it's a good card. It is so hot in my room, and I was wondering why it was so hot in my room. I've been wearing a jacket this whole time and didn't even realize it. My god. Um. Alright, last bill. Looks like I literally cleaned up the bill market. <laughs> Alright. So that's it for bills. Um. I think we can try to get Ampharos later. And uh, Absol. We, we should get Absol now, honestly. We can, we can probably get Ampharos later. Because <clears throat> I'm not going to be build, building Ampharos right away. But Ampharos is definitely a deck I want to play around with. I might build it next time. We're going to be spending the majority of tomorrow's stream just building a bunch. But I feel like plenty of people have seen my list already. I'm not in a huge rush to upload it. I definitely feel like after uploading almost daily in the month of January, I could use a break. I'm really tired. What's up, bros? On my computer, I'm about to put in hella codes. This man didn't even know he was wearing a jacket. Yep, yeah, that's me. Um, anyways, <sighs> Absol. Looks like just one team up code. That's pretty good. I only need one. Take it. So we're only, <laughs> we actually went below 100. I mean, that makes sense, which means I probably have to hold on to some codes. Um, but I guess I just have to continue hunting for a few more codes here and there. Uh, but I'm going to end the stream there, guys. My head is killing me. I have to wake up early tomorrow. I'm a busy man. But thank you guys for hanging out tonight. I appreciate it. Don't forget to check out the YouTube channels. Uh, tomorrow is the last day for entries for the booster box giveaway. If you guys, oh my God, that's so awesome. Look at this. This is sick. Um, it's the last day to enter for the booster box. So if you guys want to get a chance to get a booster box, let me know. Um, yeah. Thank you guys for hanging out tonight. We're definitely going to be playing lots of games tomorrow. And, uh, of course, donators, as always, get to battle me. Uh, so, uh, Eagle Heart gets to battle whenever because this man donates 60, like a boss. We're probably going to be doing a giveaway tomorrow, too. It is the first tomorrow, which ends our monthly giveaway. So, I think for the monthly giveaway, we're going to give away anything we open and probably 20 packs of Team Up. I think that's what I want to do tomorrow. So, if we stream tomorrow, that's going to be the game plan. I'm going to try to stream early. But, regardless, thank you guys for hanging out. Don't forget to do all the liking and chatting and sharing and help me get to 10k subscribers on youtube and uh, 50 subscribers on twitch and i'll see you guys next time peace